Christianity. Welcome, dear friends, to a journey of transformation and enlightenment, where we will explore the profound journey of embracing your strengths and overcoming your weaknesses, leading you towards a more fulfilled, happier, and God-centric life. Let us begin by reflecting on the parable of the talents, as told in Matthew 25, 14 through 30. This story teaches us the value of recognizing and nurturing the unique gifts bestowed upon us. Remember, as Philippians 4.13 inspires us, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. This powerful message encourages us to look within, to identify our strengths through self-assessment, feedback from those we trust, and most importantly, through prayerful guidance. However, understanding our strengths is only part of our journey. As Romans 7.18 teaches us, For I know that nothing good dwells in me, that is, in my flesh. This humbling reminder calls us to acknowledge our weaknesses with humility and self-awareness. It's in recognizing these personal challenges that we begin the transformative process. Reflective journaling counsel from wise and trusted individuals, and earnest prayer can be profound tools in this phase of our journey. Drawing inspiration from the Apostle Paul's testament of strength in weakness, as detailed in 2 Corinthians 12, 9 through 10, we learn that our weaknesses can become sources of unexpected strength. It is through prayer, seeking God's guidance, and establishing actionable goals that we can begin to transform our weaknesses into our greatest strengths. Let the testimonies of those who have walked this path before you serve as a beacon of hope and inspiration. Living a God-centric life, as described in the fruits of the Spirit in Galatians 5, 22 through 23, is the essence of our journey. It's about integrating these virtues into our daily lives, finding strength in community and fellowship, and committing ourselves to practices that nurture our spiritual growth, such as regular scripture reading, dedicated prayer, and selfless service to others. As we draw this journey to a close, let us heed the call of Matthew 5, 16. Let your light shine before others, that they may see your good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. This journey of personal and spiritual growth is continuous, and it requires our steadfast commitment and trust in God's divine plan. To assist you in your journey, we offer you mindbalance.net, a free online program available via website and phone apps that can assist you in identifying the strengths and weaknesses in your personality and removing the obstacles holding you back. Let us end with a prayer for strength, wisdom, and guidance on this transformative journey. May you find the courage to embrace your strengths, the grace to acknowledge your weaknesses, and the faith to transform them, all while walking a path that leads you closer to a fulfilled, joyous, and God-centric life. Amen.